Hey guys, it's me, Animal Craze, and today I'm making another toy for my bird that I don't even have yet. I still think it's kind of funny that I'm doing this, but whatever. So this video, right now, I don't know how I'm going to make this, but I have an idea on how I'm going to do it. So just follow along with me, and in the end we should have a nice looking ladder for a small bird, like a budgie. So what you're going to need for this is wood, which I just got some from outside. Make sure you heat treat it first so that it doesn't have any bugs or anything on there. Um, there's a piece of bark, let me just get rid of that. So you have to have your wood. You're going to also want to have some twine which is not any particular twine, it's just some twine that I have lying around the house. And a pair of scissors, which is my trusty pair of scissors, which I used in my last video. And let's get right into this. And I will see you in the tutorial. Okay, so let's get started. So first you're gonna wanna find two pieces of your sticks that are long like this and I can actually use that maybe as another little piece but so I have this stick right here which is a decent length and I also have this one and those are going to be the base for my ladder actually that piece is not but um this piece and the other piece are going to be the bases for my ladder and so it has a little bit of a diagonal thing there. Doesn't really matter, the bird won't care. Um, so you have your two pieces like that, and then you are going to want to start making your actual length pieces. And so I just have a whole bunch of sticks, different sizes and everything, lying around to use. So I'm gonna break this off. I'm gonna get the stick. I'm gonna get my twine. This could take a while. And again, this is my first time doing this. So, I haven't watched any videos how to do this or anything. But, I would just say, you're going to want to try to tie this as tight as you possibly can. And tie it multiple times so there's that's just my first time that so that's really loose right now but you can pull it very tight and make it all nice and everything and you're gonna want to do this for each side then I'm going to wrap this around here, like this, and then just like pull it through there. And while I'm doing this, I am doing this very, very tight so that it will not come apart. And then I get this very tiny piece and I loop the string through it, which I messed up, sorry about that. Actually, I am going to get one of the pieces that I looped earlier, so this loop right up here, and I am going to try and slide my string underneath it like this just like this and I'm going to pull that tight and wrap it around and bring it through another one of these and if you cannot do this then you 
you should I should have probably since this is my first time doing it, I probably should have like done something a bit different with the string part of it. Um but oh well this is something I guess I'll learn if I make, decide to make some more of them. This is my first time and a first attempt and everything, so if it doesn't work out perfectly, the bird will still be able to use it. And that's all I'm trying to get from this one, is this functionality. It doesn't matter how good it looked. It is purely based on how well it stands up to the bird chewing on it and everything. So I am going to do the rest. I'm going to get this next side done on film so that you can see that. I'm going to just cut this up here right there like that. And I'm going to get this on there and tie that on. And then I will speed up the video and I'll have a time lapse of me doing the rest. And I'll get back to you right after I'm done doing that. So this time, I know what my mistake was. So I'm going to get quite a bit of string this time. And I'm going to go up through the bottom like so. And then I'm going to tie this. Sorry if my head's in the way. But um, I'm going to tie this like that this is just a loose knot this one's not a very strong one yet this is going to build up into my strong knot though I'll be right back okay sorry about that um so we, we just have to try depending on how how much string I use this one could be a little bit different to tie and everything so here I'm gonna do another knot quick now it's time that I need to start trying to do this very tightly And this is what's going to make it so that the bird just doesn't break through the thing. And of course, if you have a bigger bird, you can make this just with different size sticks. You're going to have to use like a log or something, I guess, maybe. Maybe not a log, but you get the idea. Use a bigger stick. So that's our first one. It's a little loose. Could have been tighter. There's no way the budgie would be able to get that mess up like that. But, um, yeah, I'm going to get this finished up. I'm going to do a time lapse of it so you can see me work on it. And I will see you once I have that finished. So I will see you there. Bye.